I came back, uh, I stayed in my playbook and stuff during the offseason and uh, just rehab 24-7. So it wasn't no big adjustment. Just uh, getting, back to, getting back together with my teammates, having fun. Yes, sir. Uh, I just think, wake up, thank God that I came back as fast as I could. And uh, I just count down the days. Yes, sir. Uh, I woke up every morning uh, with a big old clock on my wall, man, with a picture of Patrick Willis, man, and it just went at it every single day. I, got, I had doubters and this and that. I can't. I maybe can't make it back. This is season in the injury and things like that. But I just, you know, ground my teeth and you know, put my head down the grind. Well, Michigan a good team, so we got to go out there and play our game and, you know, uh, and, play, and have fun and play youth, youth ball, you know. And uh, as a defense, we're going to fly around and make plays like like we've been doing the uh, first two games, so we're going to do that for the Michigan game. Uh, no, sir. Uh, Jason Wynn, he's a great guy, man, great leader, man. When he got hurt, man, I kind of downed him, kind of felt his pain, but, you know, uh, we – you know, we got the next man in mentality. So one go, one soldier go down, the next soldier. Up. He looks like he's uh, in good good shape as far as uh, coming back off the, uh, the injury. He's showing no ill effects so far. You know, it's only been a, a few days, but but uh, it's coming at the right time. We need him desperately to, to uh, play some good football for us. He's playing this week, so he's he's very close. We feel like he's ready to do it. Yeah, you know, he uh, hasn't been in a game, but he has been playing, you know, practicing all last fall as a redshirt spring until he obviously got the injury but uh there'll be a little bit of rust but but uh you know he's, he's looking pretty good right now he's moving very well and he's instinctive that's that's something you can't coach his instincts and Gianni Paul is a very instinctive player